Hey everyone, how's it going? Empty here, back with another fun bot for you to add to your Discord servers. And this one is for that classic Who's That Pokemon game. You can have in your own Discord server, which I think is a lot of fun, it's classic. It could go great in your gaming servers, Pokemon servers, whatever you may have. So real quick, I'm just gonna show you how to add it and get it going. It's pretty great, as you can see here, the Pokemon simply pop up, then you just simply type the Pokemon's name out, and it gives you a point. There's a leaderboard, which is awesome. So you have a server-wide leaderboard, and then you have a global rank leaderboard, so your server can keep an eye on that, and I'll give you guys some tips about that stuff as well. So let's jump right into it. The first thing, of course, is you gotta invite the bot to your server. So a link for that will be down below in the description. So just click that link, which will be this up here. So then you just simply log in, or if you're on your PC already logged in, it will just bring it up in the app like this. Then you just select your server. Let's go to the hidden tacos, hit continue. Doesn't need any admin permissions or anything crazy like that. So you just authorize. I'm definitely not a robot, are you? Now if we head on over to our server, the bot is there, which is great. So now we just need to add a channel for it. You're just gonna create a normal channel like you always do. Let's call this one, Who's That Pokemon? Great. So once you have the bot invited and the channel made, that's pretty much all you need. Then you're just gonna hit this command here and then hit enter and boom, you're good to go. So yeah, super easy. And then people can start guessing like this is obviously a Pikachu, correct? But if you're stumped, you hit this question mark and get a hint. You get a hint every 20 seconds. If you super can't figure it out, then you just hit skip. I will tell you what it was and then give you your next guess. And that's on a, like a 20 second cooldown. So that's not too bad. The crown will show you your server rank. So this is just only on this one particular server. And then the earth will show you the global rankings. So I think the fact that it has both these leaderboards is great. Definitely the server wide one, because your server is definitely gonna love that if you have multiple people going for that first spot. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Now just for some quick tips to help your server out. I definitely recommend having a pinned post with something like this, just super simple. I always recommend this for and whenever you're adding a new bot, just to let people know what it is and how it works. So something plain, just explaining what the bot actually is and make sure you mention that there's a leaderboard and just have the couple of commands that are actually in here. You see the commands here, you have a hint, skip. And again, you can do these commands in the chat or just hit the buttons like I showed you. And then just something else fun I want to show you guys, which is a possibility you might want to do. I see here for Polywalks Palix, my server, this is the current rankings. So something fun you can do, you can see Aiden's currently in first place. So as you can see here, we gave him a special role. Since he's first place, he gets the Who's That Pokemon leader role. You can name it whatever you want, Who's That Pokemon champ, etc., etc. But I think it's just fun, just something fun for the leader to currently have. And again, that's not automatic. That's something you know we have to keep an eye on and just take away and then add row as needed. But I think that's fun. It gives the top person something cool to have. If you want to change the prefix or other things, here's additional commands. Something else you might want to do is see here, you can actually reset your server rankings. So maybe something you want to do is just have a weekly leaderboard. So at the end of the week, you give the top spot or top three spots some prizes, depending on what you're doing in your server, and then just reset the rank. Or you just keep it the whole time. Just trying to give out a couple of different ideas you might want to try out on your server. Oh, and before I forget, one other thing I did want to mention because, I, like I said, you start playing by hitting this command. So, of course, if someone wants to be naughty, they could go into another different channel of yours and hit that, and it will start as well. So, if you don't want that happening, just make sure you go into that specific channel, go to your permissions, add the bot, then make it so you cannot view that channel, right? So, now if someone goes in and tries to use it, like I just closed the comment one. It doesn't see it, so it's not going to start it up in that channel. So yeah, if you want to keep it specifically, definitely lock to one channel. That's how you would do it. But yeah, it's not a very common command, so hopefully people aren't setting off in a bunch of other channels of yours anyways. But yeah, it's definitely a very cool bot. Shout out to the creator for making it. It's definitely a lot of fun. Uh, definitely try it out on your server. Let me know in the comments below how you guys are enjoying it, how you liking it. And if you want to play over on my server, then that's Polywalks Palix. A description for this server will be down in the link below. Feel free to drop on by and say hello. We're mainly a Poke2 server, but we have a lot of other stuff as well. So drop on by sometime. Love to see you. Thanks a lot for watching, everybody. Catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye.